What's going on YouTube? Welcome to the video and welcome to Apex Point. This is a new game on Steam. It's not really a new game. It came out 2018, I think. So still early access. I know, I know. I've already downloaded a mod menu. You already have unlimited money. I know what you're thinking. It's okay. It's okay. I went and bought ourselves a Honda Civic. Now I haven't done anything to this car. Check my inventory. I haven't done anything to it. This is the way that it comes. Missing headlights, missing the front bumper, no hood. Missing the rear bumper, tail lights. Interior looks pretty bare. But as far as I know, I think the distributor is in pretty bad shape. Everything else seems to be fine. I think that we can make a decent car out of this. So, how about we fix this thing up? Where do we start? Obviously, we're missing a couple body panels. A few of the engine parts have seen better days. So, what's the very first thing we should do? Should go buy some parts. Now, I remember the distributor was pretty bad. So was the ECU. But none of that matters. All we want is the biggest turbo that we can put on this. So that's what we're going to get. One spinny boy added to our cart. We'll also need the intercooler piping. We're going to get hood exit exhaust. We'll need the intercooler itself. And we'll also need the turbo header. I think that's everything. Let's go ahead and make sure. That was not everything. I forgot the intake manifold. Now, I believe that's everything. So, we're going to start off. Rip off this fuel rail. Uh and the throttle body and the intake manifold. And then we're gonna put on the turbo intake manifold, stock fuel rail, turbo throttle body. Um, and then we need to take off this exhaust, put the, uh, is this? Yes, the header, the turbo, the intercooler, Piping the intercooler itself and the hood exit exhaust. Very nice. Doesn't that look so much better? Yeah, sure, I know. It's still missing body panels. We didn't fix that. But we have a spinny boy. Do we actually need a bumper or headlights? No, 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 no. Now I forgot to do a baseline dyno on this car. I apologize. I was just too excited. But we're going to go ahead and throw it on the dyno now. Alright, let's get this thing started. Not sure if it's supposed to be shooting flames out like that, but it looks cool. Alright. Let's go ahead and see what this thing can do. Alright, fifth gear. Two hundred and ninety one horsepower. Not bad for a stock four cylinder with a turbo. Alright. Head back to the garage. And I think the next thing we need to do is head to the drag strip. So I'll see you guys when we get to the drag strip. Alright guys, here we are at the drag strip. Let me change the camera view real quick. Here we are in our beautiful Civic. And we're going to try to see what kind of quarter mile time we can get out of this thing. So if we pull over here, should get the prompt. Oh, 
quarter mile. Yes, sir. Looks like we're already spinning. All right, 1683. Not the best in the world, but obviously we were spinning. The clutch was probably slipping. So let's go ahead and head back to the garage. All right, guys, we're back at the garage. Our trip to the drag strip, it left a lot to be desired. So I think the only logical thing to do would be to give it more power, right? I mean, we were spinning. The aerodynamics probably weren't the best. So the only way to overcome those things is more power. So what can we change to give it more power? Let's see. Our... Everything seems to be fine up here. Our can shaft's at 70%. That's plenty fine. Crank shaft's at 73. Distributor's at 7. I've seen worse. ECU's at 6. Could use a new battery. No. I've got just the idea. That's right. Paint match. We painted the wheels, couplers, and our head cover, valve cover. Same difference. That's got to be worth at least 10 horsepower. So let's head back to the drag strip and see what kind of difference that made. We was at a 1673, if I remember right. I'll see you guys when we get to the drag strip. Alright guys, here we are at the drag strip. Let's see what kind of time we can put down with this thing quarter mile we was at a 1673 if I remember right come on we can beat a 1673 look at that 16 oh don't wreck please 1624 at 166 that is improvement not sure if that's the right word but let's head back to the garage see what else we can do to soup this thing up all right guys we're back at the garage now and i can't seem to put a finger on why we're spinning it's probably got something to do with these tires is that really the issue? I, I think there's only one way to find out. That's right. More go fast parts. We're going to put a cam. Upgraded distributor. Mm. Yeah, might as well. Upgraded fuel, fuel rail. Let's see. What else can we do here? I think that's everything. You know what? Performance alternator belt and time belt. That's got to be worth mm, 10 horsepower each. All right, let's go ahead and get these parts swapped. Look at this amazing paintwork. We've got blue wires, purple camshaft gears, red belts, and this is supposed to be paint matched, but it's like bright orange. But you know what? The more colors, the more power, right? Let's go ahead and throw this thing on the dyno. All right, we're on the dyno now. Get it started. Get the oil warmed up. All right, should be nice and warm now. Go ahead and put it in gear. Roll through these gears. Second, third, fourth. All right, we're in fifth gear. You guys ready? Two hundred and eighty-seven. Something doesn't seem right. Let's see. Why would it not build boosts? Hmm. And let's see. Auto RPM, all the way up. Limiter, all the way. Boost, all of it. Get this thing started. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. Let's get rolling through these gears. Two hundred and eighty four wheel horsepower. That was a massive but oh no. Our clutch torque is only two hundred and fifty what is this Newton meters? I don't know what that is in bald eagles, but it's not enough, clearly, if we're putting down four hundred and eighty two up here. Our clutch can only handle two fifty. So let's head back to the garage. What can we do? to fix that. I know. We do massive, massive burnouts. I can already tell a difference. Alright, let's see how much the burnouts really helped. I know this thing's getting hard to start. Alright, fifth gear, here we go boys. If I can... Look at that, 559 horsepower. What did I tell you guys? I knew... I know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's head to the drag strip. See what kind of time this thing can put down. We trying to beat... What was it? 16.2? 16.3? I'll meet you guys over there. Alright guys, here we are at the drag strip. Let's see what kind of time. We're trying to beat a 16.2, 16.3. Shouldn't be an issue with 600 horsepower. Oh, 16.4. This thing's just getting slower. I know what the problem is. I know what the problem is. Let's head back to the garage. The problem is, everything's all different colors. If the colors matched, this thing would be at least a 15 second car, right? So, let's head to the paint shop. And... What color? Perfect. Oh wait, we missed a spot. Perfect. I think the only thing left to do is to head back to the drag strip and see what kind of time this beautiful, beautiful car can do. All right, pulling up to the line, hoping for a 15 second pass. still spinning and it's pulling hard to the right oh my goodness there's our 15 second pass I've been doing this wrong the whole time 15 seconds it can't get much better than that oh but it can let's get these puppies off of here because there's we're just spinning the tires the entire track and that's not how you set records no you set records with drag slicks that's right we got 15 by 12s and 31550 drag radials now look at this thing what is not to love 
Let's go ahead and lower it back down. One eternity later. Just a little bit more. There we go. Oh my goodness. I love it. I love it, but does it work? 15. Can we get a 14? Come on, you got it. 1387. Oh my gosh, this thing is rolling. But obviously, it gets better, right? It has to. We can't stop there. What is it missing? Besides body panels. I know. I know what'll fix this puppy right up. More burnouts. Uh, what? It doesn't do it doesn't do second gear burnouts anymore. So we wrap this up for first. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 35, 40. 50. Oh there's a wall. But no, seriously. We're gonna do what every Honda boy dreams of. That's right, you guessed it. Put a better exhaust tip. Obviously, because one flame out of the hood, that's cool. Two flames, one there, one here, eh. One flame there, two flames here, perfect. No, seriously, we're going to do what all Honda boys actually dream of doing. That's right, we're going to be all-wheel drive swapping this thing. You didn't think I was serious, did you? No, 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 no. Rough. All the camber. As low as it'll go. Confirm. As low as it'll go. All the camber. Horse and buggy. This beautiful thing. Oh my goodness, I'm in love. I'm not even a Honda boy and I'm in love. But the real question is, does it do? Does it still do burnouts? That's a silly question. But I feel like there's more we could do. What else? The only thing to make this thing better would be if the wheels matched. So much more amazing. Guys, 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 obviously I'm kidding. Yes, we're going to all-wheel drive swap it. Yes, we're going to put the better clutch in. But, it's not for the reason that you think. What's better than long-standing burnouts? There's only one thing, and that's all-wheel drive burnouts. And also reverse donuts. For those of you that think I'm some kind of sick animal that only cares about looks, no, no, no. We're gonna, we'll see what this thing can do. We can stay out of the wall. Nine fifty-one. Are you kidding me? A car that runs nine seconds in a quarter mile. And looks this amazing? Surely it's illegal. Ow. Would you look at that? Yeah. That's going to do it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like. Comment what you guys thought about it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. I'll catch you guys in the next one.